but the game that I think that even the girls partook in was the highly classic one, two, three, not it. This was out of hand. Just the intensity. What are you doing? Some kids it didn't even sound like they were. <laughs> some kids, it didn't sound like they were speaking English. What are you doing? One time, I thought my buddy Jacob Bittner had developed Tourette syndrome. <laughs> no way, I totally beat you at the, what are you doing? At the monkey bars yesterday. <laughs> Big slot. And that was it. Completely absolved of needing to prove further one iota. Just kind of accepted by everyone. <laughs> what if the one, two, three, not it rule <coughs> was implemented by our justice system? <laughs> so, <laughs> Mr. Rollins, you were present at the scene of the crime on the night in question with a 38 Magnum firearm and a hand grenade. What did they not? No, your, your fingerprints were everywhere. What did they not? There's a picture of you killing the victims while holding up a sign that says, "Yes, I'm doing this right now." <laughs> your Honor, objection. Uh, he's harassing my client. I mean, my client's given him two threes and several not its. What? <laughs> 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 he did give you the three, Mr. Davis. Fine, fine, fine. I withdraw my previous questions. Just tell me this. Where were you? Davis and I are going to jail. No, you are going to jail. Davis in the quarter cell. <sighs> I have no further questions. <laughs> Which, of course, is the lawyer's version of the one, two, three, not it rule. <laughs> this is the end. I have no further questions. Like he just made the point of the century. <laughs> so, Mr. Rollins, isn't it true that the person you had sexual relations with, or rape as I would call it, <laughs> was either a 16-year-old girl or a four-year-old boy? Hmm? What, what, what does that even mean? <laughs> I have no further questions. <laughs> Single-handedly responsible for the current war in Iraq. Isn't that true, Mr. Rollins? What are you talking about? I have no further. <laughs> <laughs> like movie previews. Movie previews are the same everywhere you go. If it's an action thriller, it's going to be the same as every other action thriller. I mean, it could be the least active, most unthrilling thing. It could be about the fucking SATs. In a world of illiterates. <laughs> one man rises to meet the challenge. Sixteen hundred questions. Two. Number two pencils. <laughs> And only one college. There's nowhere to run. Number 53 has you stumped. <laughs> to shake is to quiver. <laughs> As ubiquitous is to. <laughs> Lots. <laughs> Verbal fear. A new movie by John Frankenheimer. It's just a test. Isn't it? <laughs> it could be about absolutely anything. <laughs> this little piggy went to market. <laughs> Little piggy stayed home. <laughs> this little piggy had roast beef. <laughs> this little piggy had none. <laughs> we. 
are such cheeseball known brains that they wouldn't just lead you into their mindless suckerdom. This probably wouldn't even face them. You know, they would just probably go right ahead with their and ladies and gentlemen, this clever combination pubic hair dye slash toothpaste <coughs> is not gonna cost you two thousand dollars. Like I know you're probably thinking. <laughs> Who is thinking this? <laughs> and guess what? What? It's not going to cost you $1,999. Well, they're just going to just plain loose money on this then. <laughs> $1,998? Fine, but they couldn't possibly drop it any lower than, or even $1,997.50. Like I know you're all probably thinking like that. <laughs> Dear God, he's lost his mind. <laughs> At this point, they have red X's all over the screen. <laughs> and they drop the price by $2.50. <laughs> this is referred to in sales as the drop down. You start at a price that is so high that when you bring it down to a price that is lower than what you originally heard, that you're sold on the idea that it's such a bargain that you don't notice two things. One. And it costs way more than combo cream that you put in your mouth and on your penis should cost in the first place. <laughs> and two, I don't know, that you don't fucking need it at all. Can you imagine using this technique in other venues? Maybe this would improve my sex life. Now, Deborah, I am not going to make you fuck me in five hours. <laughs> Like I know your problem. <laughs> I wasn't thinking that at all, actually. That's right. And not in four hours? And not even in three. Um, this is our first date, and you're pretty gross. And because of that, I'm gonna <laughs> I am going to offer a first date only package deal. <laughs> I am going to fuck you. Are you ready for this? Right now. And if you act immediately, I'll come on your face. Pick up the phone and call. <laughs> Who do you want me to call? 